Even though there are still cranes at both ends of the Cedar Bridge, construction crews are nearly finished with this historic landmark. Smoldering burnt wood was once all that remained of the Cedar Bridge in April 2017. Arsonists destroyed the iconic replica. But now, visitors can soon make their way to a bright red number three. It's just sort of been a hole in the community in that time, and so we're very excited that Cedar Bridge is back. Heather Riley is excited to shorten her answer when people ask the Chamber of Commerce where to find Madison County's famed covered bridges. We don't have to go through another season of greeting guests and tourists to Madison County and say, well, you can't go to Cedar Bridge because we had an arson incident there. Donors from across the globe contributed $720,000 for the rebuild. Really our friends from around the world who love Cedar Bridge like we do came through with checks and donations as well. So we're very grateful for that support. Construction is nearly finished. Crews still need to do more painting and add gravel. This will be the first of the covered bridges to be equipped with a fire suppression system designed to prevent any possible need for a fourth. I think we're, we're, we made the right decisions and Cedar Bridge is going to be wonderful. Now the bridge is not open to the public yet. They do expect it's going to be ready this summer, definitely in time for the Covered Bridges Festival this fall. In Madison County, Alex Schumann, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.